Hi, and welcome to OnlineComputerTips.com video training. In this video, we're going to show you how to customize your start menu and your taskbar. And as we click on start, we have the default Windows XP start menu, which has all the new features, but some people don't like this. They prefer the look of the uh, Windows 2000 older classic menu. So we're going to show you how to change that and how to configure your taskbar settings. The easiest way to do that is to right click anywhere blank on your taskbar and choose properties. And here you'll see what options you have. Like for example, this one here is to hide inactive icons, which we count for your icons right here. If you were to choose that, it would hide the ones that are not commonly used. And of course, you'll still be able to get to them. It'll have a little arrow there that'll allow you to click on that and see them all. This one here is pretty obvious. It's to show the clock down here, whether you want that to show or not. Which will also let you show the date. And this one here is one of the more uh, popular ones. Show the quick launch. If you click that, you click on apply. It'll show your quick launch icons here for Show Desktop and Internet Explorer. Those are the defaults. And you can also drag in some other icons from your desktop or wherever to kind of customize that. Group the similar taskbar buttons. This will let you have, let's say you had a bunch of Internet Explorer windows open. Instead of having them take up your whole taskbar, we'll put them all in one place and you could click on like a drop down menu and kind of select each one from there. Uh, keep the taskbar on top of other windows. If you were to uncheck this, see how this goes underneath. If you were to uncheck it, and apply, and this, and then there you go. It'll cover the top there. But we don't like that, so we're gonna put that back and hit apply. That way it goes behind it. Auto hide the taskbar. That hides the taskbar until you put the mouse next to it. Some people like it. Some people don't. I don't. We're gonna put that back. And then lock the taskbar. If you uncheck that, it will, you could move the taskbar around. Got to fly first. You can move the taskbar around to wherever you want to go and change it like that. So that's kind of up to you if you want to keep that. And start menu. Here's the Windows XP start menu. And here's the classic start menu. So if you click on apply there and OK, now you notice we have the default start menu for Windows 2000 and older. And that way shows programs, documents, settings, all that good stuff. All it's kind of my opinion easier to use so but it's easy to change back. Just go back to the start menu tab and click on there. And that's pretty much it. And that shows you how to customize your taskbar and start menus. Thanks for watching.